Hi, Lauren Wireman, creator of Wildflowers. I can't wait to teach you this easy pop-up lotus nail. Begin with the Wildflowers base gel on the natural nail and cure for 30 seconds. Grab a Wildflowers clear form and the Wildflowers pink build in a bottle. Apply the form and then we're going to build the extension edge with the pink build in a bottle. I like to do it with pink because it's easy to see. Cure for 30 seconds and then we need to coat over the entire thing to lock it all together. Cure that for 30 seconds and then we're going to build up the apex. So you want to put a nice slippery layer on the nail and then grab a big glob and apply that glob to the center of the nail. Be patient and let the product flow into place. Turn it on its side to check to make sure it's flowed correctly. Perfect. Care for 30 seconds. Remove the tacky layer, file and shape it, and then we're going to apply gel polish. Cure for 30 seconds. Now I'm going to use the magenta foil. I love this stuff. I'm just popping it on the edge of the nail. The whole background is sticky, so I'm going to use the brown micro glitter and the autumn micro glitter to create a little bit of depth on the corner of my nail. Grab the Wildflower Scrubby Brush. Begin with the brown glitter. That's the one I want to see the most, so I'm going to start by sticking that into the sticky layer, and then I'll come on top with the color autumn. I press it into place, give it a little dusting to just make sure that it lays flat, and then I'm going to coat this with the Wildflowers Top Coat Gel. You want to make sure that there's nothing uh, hanging off loose because it will contaminate the top coat gel. You don't want to get glitter in your top coat if you can help it. After that's cured, I'm going to grab the Wildflowers White Pop-Up Gel and the Wildflowers Indigo Brush. I'm going to dry brush and make some beautiful flower petals. You want to work with the brush kind of dry, so it might be a little frayed and um, wild, but that's what you want to really get the proper texture. So get a little glob on the tip of the brush, press down, and then swing over. So as you can see, I'm making them sort of a mirror image of each other and I'm letting the little tail just sort of disappear. I'll do one on the other side. So when you do this, again, you get a little blob on the tip of the brush, press, and then as you pull towards the center of the flower, release the pressure from your brush by lifting up a little bit and that will give you that little skinny tail. Now I'll add a couple little spots at the top. Again, pressing and pulling. I call this motion the eyebrow stroke. And one last one up at the very top. Cure this for 30 seconds. Wipe it with a little bit of isopropyl alcohol and that is it. So easy, it's just so easy. I love this design, it's elegant and easy. Be sure to check out this month's online course from the No Show Nail Academy called Feathers and Roses. Just go to wildflowersnails.com and click on online classes. If you want to shop on our website, our website is www.wildflowersnails.com. There you will find products, classes, everything you saw in this video. Uh, if you want to come to one of our hands-on workshops, just visit our website, click on classes or workshops. Uh, you can click enroll to see what we have coming up. Our next big, big class is in February. It's called Master Artists Week. Uh, there you will take eight nail art classes. It is a week of nail art glory. You'll create 48 nails yourself. Um, I will be there to help you hands on for that class. So again, it's in February. It's a week long class. I hope you'll be able to make it out to that. We'll also soon be posting our schedule of um, some of the other shows that we'll be uh, attending throughout the year where you can catch us. Um, so I look forward to meeting you. I look forward to teaching you more and um, consider coming to our Master Artist Week. It's an amazing way to invest in your nail career. Again, you can shop online anytime at wildflowersnails.com. Be sure to subscribe to our channel for tutorials every Thursday, and we are going to have some online classes coming up soon, so stay tuned. Thanks for watching.